Hey everybody, this is Brian, and today we're going to be going over Eclipse. This is the Eclipse SDK. Um, basically, this is very popular IDE for Java. What's an IDE? Well, if you watch the VB tutorials, you know it stands for Integrated Development Environment. And as you can see, it's got a lot of menus, a lot of options, very confusing. First time walking into it, you have no idea what any of this stuff is. Take a deep breath, relax, don't worry, we're going to cover a lot of these. Now, I don't believe in just giving you a boring tutorial over the entire IDE, so I'm going to go over these as we need them. For now, what you need to know is your package explorer, or your workspace, is on the left. Then you have outline and properties. And then you have problems, Java doc, declarations, and console. And then right here is where your code is going to be. Well, this is a little cluttered, so you should know that you can minimize these. You see how it collapses, and then you can restore it. So we're going to clean up a lot of this workspace here. Give us a nice big area to work with. And at any time you want to bring them back, you just bring them back. Clicking Restore. You can also do individual items. Like, for example, you want to see the console. Notice how when you do that method, it disappears when you click off. So to restore it, just click the Restore button. Pretty simple. Um, as you can see, the version we're using is the Eclipse SDK version 3.6.0. You get this from eclipse.org slash platform. And this also includes software from the Apache Foundation. Um, probably when you first start this, you're going to see a screen that looks like this. Um, this is the welcome screen. And it gives you tutorials, overviews, samples, what's new, etc., etc. To get to where I was, you just click Workbench. It brings you right back here. And if any time you want to go back, you just go back to the welcome window, which is right here under help. Now, admittedly, I'm still fairly new with Eclipse, so you may see me fumble around the interface a little bit. Just kind of bear with me, and we'll figure this out as we go. Thank you for watching. I hope you found this video educational and entertaining.